Hey folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. I am going to show you how to apply default transitions. I'm also going to show you how to change the duration of the default transitions. And then I'm going to show you how to set the default transition. If, to apply the default transition in Premiere Pro, just simply select two clips and hit Command D. Sequence, apply video transition, Command D. That is a shortcut that you really want to know. I use this all the time. And I'll just show you what it looks like here. It's going to take this clip make it blend into this clip nice and smooth. To apply transitions to a whole bunch of clips at the same time, just simply drag over them, hit Command D. And now you can see it put it at the beginning, in between each clip and at the end. So if you click on that transition in between two clips, if you don't want one, just hit delete, it'll get rid of it. Undo that, or you can click on it. You can make it shorter. So if I do it like this, the transition is gonna go really quickly between the two, or I can drag it out and make the transition long. If you want to be precise, you can just simply click on the transition, right click, set transition duration, and you can put in exactly how you want. If you want to change the duration default, so every time you apply the transition, it'll set it to a certain time, you have to go up here to Premiere Pro, Preferences, come down to Timeline, and now here you can change the default from anything you want. It's currently set to one. If I was to change it back to three, select the two clips, Command D. And now you have the three second as the default transition. So the actual default transition itself is cross dissolve. I keep it at that. That's the one that I use the most. But if you did want to change that, you can just go up in the effects. See that little blue stroke around that? That's telling you that's the default. If I wanted any one of these, or instead of cross dissolve, right click on it, set as default transition. If I undo this, get rid of that one, hit Command D. Now I have dip to white as my default transition. So that is transitions in Premiere Pro, something you're gonna be using all the time. Get to know Command D. Cheers.